We know it can be overwhelming to learn that your child has a congenital heart defect. Our team of specialists are here to support you and answer your questions. In this video, we'll discuss what it means if your child is diagnosed with transposition of the great arteries, as well as what we'll do to treat it. If your child has been diagnosed with D or dextro transposition of the great arteries, DTGA, this means that their aorta, the main body artery to the heart, connects to the right ventricle, and the pulmonary artery, the main lung artery, connects to the left ventricle. This results in blood without oxygen, blue blood, being pumped repeatedly back to the body, while blood with oxygen, red blood, is pumped repeatedly through the lungs. As a result, the baby's body and major organs don't get as much oxygen as they should. It's important that we address this quickly after birth. As a first step, we'll give your child prostaglandin, a medication that helps open the ductus arteriosus, a fetal connection between the aorta and pulmonary arteries. This will allow more oxygenated blood to get to the body. In some cases, we'll also perform a balloon atrial septostomy not long after birth. This procedure creates a larger hole between the upper chambers and further improves the amount of oxygenated blood getting pumped to the body. The final and most important step is to perform an arterial switch operation. We'll do this within the first week of your child's life. This operation will surgically switch the main arteries back to the correct pumping chambers. If a balloon atrial septostomy is performed, the hole will be closed during surgery. The Children's Heart Center team is with you every step of the way. Learn more by visiting choa.org/tga.